Hi there, welcome to Nifty Invest. Every single day I am looking for potential breakouts in a company's share price. And there are two particular setups I am looking out for every single day. The first one is potential breakouts on positive announcements. And the type of positive announcements I am looking out for are profits or revenue upgrades. I'm also looking out for drilling results from mining companies, trial results from biotechs or material contracts. And the other thing I will be doing when I see these um, positive announcements is looking at how the market reacts. That's a very important stage or step in these potential breakout setups. The other setup I am looking out for are just shifts, very simple shifts in sentiment and a new uptrend developing in a share price. And this setup isn't reliant on positive announcements. It just could be a shift in how the market is thinking about a company. In this particular video, I'm going to be focusing on a company that did release a profit upgrade on December 17. And that company is Swoop. So we'll be looking at that announcement and then we we'll are looking to see how the market reacted to this profit upgrade. I haven't done much research on Swoop, but I do know they are a fixed wireless internet provider. I could be a little, mis little bit mistaken on some aspects of that, but they haven't been around long on the ASX. So have a look at the chart. Uh, it only goes back to about May of this year. Anyway, on the 17th of December, 2021, they did release a business update and upgraded guidance. As soon as I saw the words upgraded guidance, I became interested in this announcement and this company. They have upgraded financial year 22 revenue from a range between 50 and 50, I mean 43 and 45 million to 50 to 53 million. And that actually represents 72% year on year growth from financial year 21. They've also increased their expectations on underlying EBITDA from a range between 10.5 and 11 million to 12 to 12.5 million. And that represents 150% growth, year on year growth from financial year 21. So just by looking at these numbers, looking at the change in guidance, I expected a pretty good a pop on the share price on open. So let's have a look to see how the market reacted to this announcement. The data chart for SWIFT goes all the way back to May of this year. I'm not sure if this was an IPO, backdoor listing, or maybe they just changed their name. I don't know anything about the history of this company. I just know a, a little bit about what they do. There was a little bit of hype in regards to SWOOP between July and September of this year. The share price almost tripled from about um, 88 cents to a high of $2.00 and 45 cents during that period. But from that high we did see in September, the share price has been under pressure, has moved into a short-term downtrend, and there is a little bit of negative sentiment in regards to this company. And I thought because of that negative sentiment, because there would have been a lot of shareholders who bought at higher prices over the last three or four months, this announcement would give them the opportunity to sell out. I did expect the share price to rise on open, maybe between 10 and 20%, and there would be significant volume compared to what we've been seeing over the past six months. But it did not happen like that. The market had a complete lack of interest in this announcement. There was a mooted um, reaction. There was no reaction, in fact. The share price actually fell uh, in the day trading by one cent. It actually fell from $1.50 to $1.49, and if you look at the volume, there was no volume. There was no interest in this announcement from Swoop, which is very unusual for a lack of interest when a company releases a profit or earnings upgrade. And that means either the market was expecting this, so that's a possibility, or the market hasn't had time to digest the announcement, and there's gonna be a delayed reaction. I have seen this about two or three times in the past when a company releases a positive announcement and there's no reaction from the market on the day they release the announcement, but then two or three days later, we see that reaction and the share price increases by a significant amount. Will that happen with Swoop? Well, we're gonna to have to wait 
a few more trader days to see if there is a delayed reaction, but who knows why there was absolutely no interest in this announcement from Swoop, even though it is the most powerful sort of announcement a company can release. I won't call this a failed breakout of Swoop's share price because there could be a delayed reaction from this profit upgrade, but still, it was a surprise that there was no reaction from the market. So I'm really looking forward to see how the market, if it does react uh, to Swoop share price in the next few trading days. If you have any questions about this company or any other company on the ASX, please leave it in the comments section of this video. And the last thing I should mention is I am not a financial advisor. If you do need financial advice, make sure you seek out someone who is qualified and can speak to your own financial needs and circumstances. That's it for this video. Have a good day. Bye.